you want to know? Oh my god, the quality on this phone is terrible. Anyway, do you want to know what pisses me the fuck off today? Sorry. No. You want to know what one of my favorite TV shows is? Damn. It is none other than The Sopranos. I, I tell someone, have it. I can't even fucking see that. Christ, this phone is shit. Anyway, The Sopranos, right? Fucking amazing TV show, right? Nicely designed box set in terms of the artwork, front, spine, back, right? They got the fucking inside case. You know, you got James Gandolfini there as Tony Soprano. Amazing show, six seasons. HBO. But then you open it. What the fuck? Probably can't even see that. What the fuck's this shit? These discs are impossible to take out. Right? I can't pull them out, that's what she said. I said that in voice. <laughs> but seriously though. I'm trying to press this fucking thing. Goddamn discs are not coming out. I want to re-watch the show. I fucking can't. Actually, I still have to watch the rest of season 5 and all of season 6. I can't. Why? Because the fuck... Well, I can. But how the fuck am I meant to get these goddamn discs out? I've even looked up other YouTubers. Like, but no. All I'm getting is, hey guys, so I'm unboxing David Day. No. Not this and those other YouTubers. Their videos are actually very good. But it's like, dude, come on. How? How the fuck do I open it? Help me, man. It's a great cover as well. You got all the characters there. You know, you got... You got Tony, Sylvie, Christopher, Paulie, and... Uh... Sal. Yeah. Woke up this morning. Got yourself a gun. This show is amazing. And I will review it. Someday. I will do some TV show reviews here and there. Um, It's HBO. Like HBO has done so many great shows. Euphoria. The Last of Us. The Sopranos. You know. But. This. Box set. Is impossible to open. So what I'm going to do is when I get the ball, the discs out, I'm going to have to put them in individual cases. Why can't they just put it in individual cases? They've done that in America. Why not here? It's like, I wouldn't mind it if the discs were easy to take out. Like the Mission Impossible box set. They're fucking not easy to take out. Look at this shit. How the fuck do it? How? How? Season 4. And then it's arseways as well. Like... It has all the seasons, right? Be season four, disc uh, three, right? And it's season fucking five, disc one. Season, uh, disc one for like season four. And then see, disc three for season three. Like, what the fuck? Get them in the right order. Who the fuck made this box set? Seriously, who designed it? Uh, do you know what? We'll design it like this. To make it fucking complicated. I love physical media. But my fucking god. Th this much effort to get a fucking disc out of a fucking case. Like. And then this disc is loose. Um, What's it? Season 2. Disc 3. And it's like. I'm a f well, even that's hard to take out. And it's just, I'm afraid of fucking the disc up. You know? And then, oh shit, then it, like season four is behind it. And it's like, dude. How can I? Like, you know, it's just. It's really badly designed. Uh, so I don't know if I'm going to just have to have this as a collector's item and just buy the seasons individually. I'll keep this, of course. But uh, it's so annoying. 
I'm sorry. Like, this show is awesome. Like, I have Breaking Bad, right? Breaking Bad is another one of my favourite shows. The cases, for they come in individual cases. The box set for that is better because, although this has a cooler design, but the Breaking Bad one comes in individual cases. And so this one should have as well. What the actual fuck? And this was a lot of money, apparently. I know it was a Christmas gift. It was in my Blu-ray update. But it's like, it was a lot of goddamn money. So it's like, you know, I know it's like third world problems and shit. And this video is also just for entertainment value. You know, but honestly, I want to let actually ask people, does anyone else have that problem? Because, like, it's just all that effort to take out a fucking, nothing should be that hard to take out. That's what she said. Sorry. <laughs> um... You know, like, okay, here's another, right? So you got the Mission Impossible box set. I've watched all of these films now. They're fucking awesome. I'm going to be reviewing them leading up to the new one. But, I'm not saying this is the best designed either. But at least the fucking Blu-rays are easy to take out. You know? That's the same with my Indiana Jones one and my Lethal Weapon one. And, you know, it's an awkward fucking Blu-ray set as well. But it's, at least I can actually take this shit out and watch it. And, I'm sorry, this whole bullshit of, oh no, just go to streaming. Fuck streaming. Over here, The Sopranos is on Sky. That's how I watched it. Um, and, there's always ads. Oh, you can skip them. Yeah, I don't want to have to do that. The effort of doing that. You know, I don't want to go to second-hand CEX shops over here, or sex shops, to get movies. That's sex shops. Oh, now I regret fucking taking this out, because I can't fucking close the fucking thing. Great. Anyway, uh... Yeah, toward the world problems, but Sherlock, what can you do, hey? Um... You fucking comeback, sorry. Get in! Now this is fucking up. This is badly designed as well. Fuck it. Like, this comes like this. Like, wh why? So can they not just have individual cases? The Mission Impossible posters are great. We want individual cases, please. Fucking how hard is it? Uh no, we'll do discs. Should be a fucking, should be illegal. Go to prison. That was a joke, by the way. And some people take jokes seriously. Oh my fucking god, dude! Oh, god, this is fucking stupid. Honestly, this is so fucking dumb, bro. Honestly. Son of a bitch! Why? That's a Copper Cab reference, by the way. I think I already done that already, did I? Oh, no, no, I didn't. It is so fucking hot out, so it's not fucking hot. It's fucking freezing. I can't fucking, like... How am I... Oh, my God. Like, seriously. How? That's right. If this Mission Impossible Fallout Blu-ray gets scratched, I am going to be pissed. Well, they're obviously going to be designing a new box set this year when number 7 comes out. So, um, here's a, a little hint that I want to say. Uh, Paramount, design it fucking properly, please. Or however the fuck designs the fucking things. Like, who the fuck made this? Seriously. Who the fuck made this goddamn box set? You can't get any of the fucking... But you know what? You know what? Okay. 
for my Mission Impossible reviews, I need to remember not to be like uh, front spine back, right? Because this, like all of this trouble, all of this fucking trouble to get a goddamn. I don't like that being like that. Like, ugh. all this trouble to get a goddamn box set in. Like, what the f? Why? This video is for pure entertainment and comedy purposes. Oh my god, bro. Seriously. Dude. Hold on. What the f? Which way does this even go? Does it go around Mission Impossible 1 or Fallout? Like. Oh, dude. Seriously. Okay. Okay. Alright. Okay. All right, okay. Return of the Mac. Is that the way it's meant to go? No, I don't like that. I don't like that being loose. Let's see, here we go, big. This is the moment. Tonight is the night. See, I have that sound stuff in my head now. <sighs> I'm going to jump off a bridge. Do you know what? That's the best I can fucking do. Seriously, what the fuck? No, that can't be right. Is it this way? Does it go that way? No, it doesn't. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Take this out for a second, right? Take this. <sighs> Why the fuck did I pull that out? That's what she said. Oh! Oh, it doesn't go like that. You know, I'm watching Peaky Blinders right now. I'm fucking. <sighs> Random. It, I just, while watching, I was like, shit, I still need to finish The Sopranos. Anyway, love these films. I will be reviewing all of them. Whoever designed these, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Sorry, oh, fuck you. <laughs> Sorry, I can't fucking. My God. Anyway, like, and this is another fucking thing that, right, this is another goddamn thing that annoys me. I love steelbooks, but half of these goddamn things are so fucking hard to take it. Thanks, that's what she said. Um, don't you say thanks for, oh, I don't fucking know, let's see, let's see, I'm losing it, I'm losing it. So thanks to myself for pushing the fucking Bill and Ted trilogy in. Anyway, like, all the fucking shit. Um, to just fucking, like, like, Speed's a great movie. I've done a review on it. I wanted to re-watch it the other day. And I'm like, oh, it's a steelbook, isn't it? And of course, I couldn't get the goddamn disc out. How did I get the disc out in the past, you wonder? I got someone else to do it. I got someone else to do it for me. Same with The Sopranos. I shouldn't have to fucking do that. I'm 20 fucking three nearly. I'm nearly 23, okay? I'm 22. Can't take it out. What the fuck? That's not my fault though. Because a lot of other adults older than me can't. Seriously. So what's the solution? <laughs> what's the solution? Get another one. Get another copy. Have the, I'm going to keep those for the collection. And if I can find other things. Hopefully they're not out of print. I'm just going to get them. I don't want to say. Mission Impossible. We got print. So yeah. Anyway guys. This, this video like. A lot of people might go. Oh just a. A guy whining and stuff. It's like, this was actually kind of for pure comedy sake. I mean, it does annoy me, but as I said, it's toward world problems. 
So, I hope you enjoyed the video. It's for comedy's sake. If you didn't like it, that's totally okay. Don't worry, guys. No, fuck off. If you didn't like it, fuck it. I'm not joking. I'm joking! Just calm down, okay? Okay. So, I'm gonna see you guys later. Bye.